Prehistoric Island is about these guys trying to stop dinosaurs and then they're trying to like save the world. Yeah, the story is kind of hard to follow. Prehistoric Island is a film that's directed by Cool Robert, as in he's one of my friends, he's a good friend of mine, he's a very nice person, you should go check him out, I'll be sure to give a link to his movie in the description. So I have my thoughts on the other Cool Robert Well, they're pretty good, I like the editing in them, I think the editing's not that bad, they have their flaws, like I said, like every movie has flaws, but it's got some, the, this movie... Historic Ireland, I think, is honest to God, his worst one he's ever done. Now, it's not to say this movie is bad, it's not horrible, it's not bad, but to be honest, I just found it to be very average. Now, no offense to Cool Robert or any of his friends behind this movie, but I just had a lot of problems with the movie, and I am in the movie for cameos, which I am proud of, but to be honest, with a movie like that, I feel it could have been a little fixed, and if it was to get a sequel, I'll put tips as he how we can how we can approve in the sequels. It's not that this movie is story is bad, it's just it's hard to get track. It's hard to actually follow the story. It's it gets a bit boring at times and really feels unfresh. It feels like as if the movie doesn't even want to try to be good. It just wants to be a bit well weird and creepy. On to the good things about the movie. The editing is fantastic. It's almost as good as Corey's Reviews editing. In fact, it's even close to being better. Not better, but close. Almost as good. The models are pretty good. The models aren't that bad. They're at least actually enjoyable. They're awesome to look at. The editing effects are really good. I love all the green screen effects. I love it when it, a text comes up. I just think the editing is really good in what's made this film at least a little bit enjoyable. And it is a bit funny. It's a good, it's a good film to have a laugh at. It's not that the movie itself is bad. It just feels like as if it's got a lot of problems. Some things when they're shooting, I feel like there could have been at least some fire thing, like a muzzle flash effect in there. However, it just doesn't feel right. And some of the- and the characters, they're dolls, I get they're toys, but to be fair, I think they could have used humans. Sometimes you can hear humans voicing them, or it could be just one person. If there are other humans voicing them, then it should be like me where they're actually having cameos. I think that would have been at least pretty good. The editing, is, I think, is what makes the film good, and the acting is actually pretty good, minus me. But I think Robert's acting is actually quite good. He's genuine what he's given. He knows what to do, and he knows how to do it right. It's not that the movie is bad, like I said. It just it has so many problems that it is really hard to explain. Overall, guys, I'm going to give Prehistoric Island... I'm sorry, but... I'm gonna have to give it a five. It's it's not bad, it's just half of being bad and good. So I would have to give it an average. So it's not terrible, it's not the worst thing ever. It just has so many problems in it. Overall guys, what do you think of Prehistoric Island by Cool Robert? What do you think of the YouTuber himself? Go subscribe to him if you haven't, and stay tuned for my review of the Jungle Bunch. Skadoosh.